Hey guys, today is Saturday the 28th. Um, cut a full house. Uh, so my brother and his two kids are at the house right now. And my niece is the same age as my son. And then my nephew just turned two. So I've got two four-year-olds and two-year-old at my house right now. That'll be fun. Um, so I just came up to Target to pick up a few things. <sighs> Which I was going to bring the baby, but I don't, it's his nap time. And, uh, I don't have a car seat that he fits in because, um, Declan buckles. And so there's no harness on his car seat. Um, so yeah, I came to Target by myself last time I was here, I had an anxiety attack and had to calm down in the car before I could actually do my shopping. So like I was in Target and had to leave to come back to my car and sit there for like 15 minutes. Um, it's a real problem. So we're going to try this. I was able to get like a close ish parking spot, which I don't really care about. But I'm hoping it's not, <sighs> mm. I'm hoping it's not terrible inside. Um, it is nice to have a bit of a break from the kids. Like I didn't, didn't sleep last night. Like I think I finally fell asleep about 4.30. I didn't do anything. Wasn't doing anything. I was laying in bed, not sleeping. Um, so... That's just kind of how that's going. Um, <sighs> I won't vlog a whole lot today, so maybe this will be Saturday and Sunday put together. Um, just because the kids are there and my mom's going to be home all day and my brother will be there all day. Um, I do have a little bit of footage of the kids while they're, I think they're coloring. No, they're yelling. Um, they're yelling at the dog, <laughs> telling him to go away. Um, but yeah, so I might include some footage of them later, but right now I'm at Target because my nephew was napping while well, he was crying when I left, but they're trying to get him down for a nap. And <sighs> my son and my niece were napping they laid down for all of like 30 seconds and then they were up and about but they might be at least laying down resting watching a movie when I get back so I'm gonna run into Target and see about getting some shopping done <sighs> I hate the store I just want to not but anyway so I'm gonna run in and do that. The big debate is do I leave my car running while I'm inside? And I think I'm going to. That way it is warm. So I'm going to put the defrost on to make sure that I don't get too much snow piling up on my windshield because it's snowing. And I will say this, I hate coming out when it's snowing because, so we have a lot of problems in the winter with like people who have lived here their whole lives. Like they forget how to drive in the snow. It snowed like four times this year, man. You should have it down by now. And so they drive too fast for the roads. And we also have a lot of transplants from southern states like we have a big chunk of people from texas and um like georgia and those places that don't see a lot of snow and so they they drive too fast for these roads in trucks that are too big for the snow because what a lot of people don't understand is when you have an open bed truck like a pickup truck you need to weigh down your back end or you're going to be sliding everywhere. But I have noticed a lot of our accidents this winter have been locals. Which is ridiculous. But yes, if you are 
somebody from a southern state and you have a pickup truck and you've never driven in the snow and you come up to a northern state that has snow, put some weight in your back end. Like a heavy toolbox. Some like big bags of like sand. Um, just put some weight in the back end so you don't slide around like a crazy person. Um, and we do have a lot of like our high school kids, the high school boys slide around on purpose. And if you're in an empty parking lot, I don't care. If there's nobody else in that parking lot but you, do what you want. When you get on the streets or you're in a parking lot full of people, don't drive like a jackass. Like, not only are you going to wreck your vehicle, you're going to wreck somebody else's vehicle. You could injure somebody. You could injure yourself. Like, there's a lot of, there's a lot of issues. Um, but yeah, I could go on about driving in the snow all day long. Um, like, I get really anxious driving in the snow. And I've had two accidents where I was driving. Both of them were in the summer. And both of them were 30 days apart. Um, but I was 16 or 17. I know that's not an excuse. Um, none of them were in the winter. But I get anxiety driving in the winter if the roads get too bad. And so when I feel like that, if I don't have to leave, I don't go out and drive in it. Because I know that my anxiety driving in bad weather is going to put others at risk because I'm going to slow down or I'm going to get too nervous and drive too slow or maybe hit my brakes when I shouldn't. And I know, I know you don't slam your brakes when the roads are icy because then you're going to go. Um, like if you're not comfortable driving in the snow, just don't, just don't. Um, unless you need to, obviously, but like my birthday's in January. I got my driver's license in a blizzard in a big diesel pickup. But, um, yeah, anyway, I could go on all day about that, but I'm going to run into target so that I'm not leaving my mom and my brother alone in the madness. Um, even though my brother's leaving us later so he can go out. But yeah, so I'm going to stop this here. I'll probably check in when I'm done in Target and see where we go from there. Anyway, all right, I will catch you guys in a minute. Bye. All right, done with Target. Um, got a free $10 gift card. That was nice. Um, I really need to pay attention to their deals more. And also figure out if I can do it if I shop for pickup instead of going through the store. Because I would much rather do that than go in. But if I can um yeah, if I can shop or pick up and still take advantage of those deals, then I definitely will do that. <sighs> this person waiting for me to back out because they want my spot. Um, one of these days I feel like it would be funny to sit like in this parking lot in a really good spot and just sit there like with my reverse lights on for like 20 minutes. I wonder, maybe not in this parking lot though, because like it's a, it's a fair, it's a big town, but it's not like huge. I mean, it's, nobody knows me here because I made it a point not to like socialize with a lot of the people here. Um, mostly because I just generally don't like people. And we get a lot of our, like, our lifelong residents get that super um, snooty, entitled 
attitude. Like, I don't care you've lived here for 25 years. Like, I was born here too. I didn't live here my whole life. But I was born here. Um, and I don't know if that's everywhere. Like, it was, it was like that in the town I grew up in. Like, if you didn't grow up there, then you pretty much struggled. Like, my brother didn't struggle because he became, like, a varsity athlete. And I did not. I became a partier instead. So, but, yeah. And I, I don't know if that's, like, the mindset of the state or if it's like that in other places as well. Um, but I am never getting out of here. I just know it. Maybe I will go around the other way. Um, just because this is getting piled up and I'm not really appreciative of it. So I think I'm going to go out the other way to get out of this parking lot. Um, our Target is, like, it's at the, like, by the mall. So there's, like, 500 ways to get out of here. Um, that was just the most direct route to where I needed to go. And so I will go a little bit out of my way to avoid that kind of traffic jam. I'd be sitting there for 20 minutes. Um, but yeah, so that's how that's going. I definitely need to look into Target more. Also, I've decided... I've made the decision that my tax refund will go to bills first. Um, but I don't want to say I need it because I don't need one. I would like a new laptop so that I can eventually so that I can like learn how to like I'm just definitely gonna like save copies there's a turning lane here you have the wrong blinker on oh no you don't you're just like going all they went like this to turn left and like went way over to the right they did not go into the turning lane although they are from out of state and our turning lanes get covered with snow first because our plows plow inward to fill the middle of the road so that they don't fill up the sidewalks. Um, so I, I will give that to them. Like This one is not, it hasn't been plowed yet. Um, our plows definitely, they do the um, emergency routes first and then they do the bus routes and then mm, they, I want to say they do the side streets, but they really don't. Um, but yeah, so I'm thinking about getting a new laptop, but I'm torn no, cause I want to be able to like, um, not sit in one spot to edit. Like I like to move around my house, um, with my laptop work, but I bought a Google pixel book and that just, it operates more like a tablet. Like, so I, I pay for the Adobe software and like with Photoshop and some of the things that you can't, they don't have an Android app for yet. Um, I can't download those to my Pixel book because I apparently like to buy laptops that operate first as tablets and PCs secondary. So that has become a real problem. And my laptop is, it's an HP, I don't know, like, the kind, but it's one of those cheap, like, I think I paid, like, $250 for it. Um, when I first went back to school. So, that was, Declan was, like less than a year old so that thing is almost four years old um so 
and it was just one of those cheapies like it's it's going it cannot hold a charge I cannot use it if it's not plugged in for more than 10 minutes even at a full charge like it just starts to die real quick and um, just every once in a while I'm starting to notice those problems I had with my the first laptop I got out of high school and um, it's just starting to have those same kind of problems that I was having and that one like the whole hard drive um, hard drive everything crash and I lost everything on that computer so I definitely want to start getting everything backed up and um, yeah I'm just kind of rambling now but I, I need to get everything backed up onto external hard drives or like flash drives or whatever um, for storage sake uh, an external hard drive would be the easiest to accomplish so I can just have it all on one in one spot but I think for price I'm just gonna have to pick and choose what is most important like photos um, and go from there like my photos because like I would like to eventually like have all of my YouTube videos on backup because I don't um, I never really thought about it before, but um, having them backed up, but I know how like websites can get real hinky and they can crash and I just don't want to lose anything or lose everything. Um, so I would like to start having everything on a backup. So I think in the future, an external hard drive, maybe even if it's just for like my YouTube stuff, would be beneficial. Um, I don't know. Um, but anyway, so laptop recommendations, I'm definitely all for. Um, I would prefer not to get a MacBook. Um, just for price alone, my Pixelbook was a thousand dollars and at that price I really I expected it to be able to do more than it does but um, basically I paid a thousand dollars for a giant tablet with keyboard so Google not impressed I'm impressed with their phone I love the pixel 2 I'm waiting to upgrade to the pixel 4 um, I have to pay off this phone and I would like to be able to just buy it outright instead of having payments on it but it is an $800 phone or I don't even know the price of it but yeah it's a big expense so um, but this phone is on its last leg I know I know that phone companies do things like they purposely make sure your phone starts to slow down and starts to operate on a lesser quality level when they bring out newer models and this phone is just like it's not on its last leg I could probably get another year out of it but it's starting to move slower I'm starting to have less memory like it just seems like I'm having less memory I'm having to delete far more often than I would like so I just I need to get some storage solutions for my electronics um but yeah any laptops recommendations that you love or um i'm open to desktops too i would prefer to stay away from apple products like i don't know how to operate them i'm great with um android i'm great with i'm in so so with microsoft but like I don't I don't care for Apple products and it could be standing on principles because I'm the only person in my family who doesn't have Apple products um, so yeah but yeah any good laptop recommendations good for like um, video editing 
or I don't want to get your guys's hopes up um, about like a sticker shop. I don't think I'm going to be there like doing that, but there are some like stickers that I would like to create for myself, like script stickers or like habit trackers and stuff like that. Just little stuff. Um, so anything that would be good for that and video. It's mostly video editing with good storage. So yeah, let me know. And I'm going to end this here probably for the day. I don't want to say that because I always say that and then I add more, but, um, I am going to end this here because I'm going to pop into the gas station to grab something for my mom and then head home to the chaos. So I will check in with you guys in a little bit. Bye. Get out of here. That poor dog. $2,000 average for Hi. a two bedroom apartment. What are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's still Saturday. I am just relaxing on the couch. Um, <sighs> I've got some HGTV on. We talked about how we pay for cable and we never use it. It's not cable. It's like spectrum streaming or something. And one of the channels we got was HGTV, which I love, but I kind of forget about. I don't really just sit and watch TV. Um, so that's been going on for a little bit. Uh, we're getting ready to put the kids to bed here soon, I think. Nope, not soon enough. It's only 530. Um, dang it. They are exhausting with all of them. But anyway, I don't know that I'll be able to check back in tonight. Um, but I definitely will tomorrow. So I'll just add the vlogs together. What's up, baby? Um, Grandma's, Grandma's spotted this tail. Okay. Uh, now, it, my, now my thumb is all wet. <laughs> Here, take this back. No. It's not even wet. You got me wet cause Oh no, I did not. Okay, I will check in with you guys. <sighs> I'll check in with you guys tomorrow. See you later.